you guys what's up so for today's video it's actually a little bit different than my usual first impression videos um you know foundation videos this is a little bit different so today i have with me the real beauty sika spot sika dark spot corrector and Apparently it lightens them up really, it lightens up dark spots really well. So this kind of caught my eye at the store. I was at CVS at the time. So I'm going to read to you what it says on the back. It says, lighten up Sika Spot Corrector. Gentle but effective cream infused with white willow bark concentrate helps correct unwanted dark spots, improving the look of skin's clarity and tone. And then on the other side of the box, it said, Break the cycle with real beauty. Advanced vegan skincare system formulated to balance and calm your skin's fluctuating needs throughout the month. Made with potent naturally derived ingredients and without the use of toxic or irritating chemicals, period. Directions. Apply a thin layer on desired areas of skin. Use when needed, morning and night after cleansing. And then for warning, it just says for external use only, obviously. If irritation or discomfort occurs, discontinue use and consult physician immediately. Avoid contact with eyes. Keep out of reach of children. And I'm going to tell you what it's made with. Made with H3O, hyaluronic acid complex, white willow bark extract, centella. I can't pronounce this word. Ajotica extract made without synthetic fragrance, artificial dyes, parabens, PEGs. I cannot pronounce this word, it's a really long word. Pheno, phenoxethanol, mineral oil, silicone, sulfates, phthalates, animal derived ingredients. So, this. I'm really hoping it will start to correct my under eyes where there's not severe dark spots, but I do have some mild dark spots that I do want to correct. So it says to apply, apply after cleansed skin. So I prepped my skin and cleansed it with my Fenty Skin collection. That's my skin routine, which is the total cleanser the fat water milky toner essence and the hydrovisor moisturizer and SPF. So we're going to open this up. See what it looks like. Put the box over there for now. Okay. Oh, it's a nice it's a pretty little tube. Check that out. That's what it looks like on the front. You get 20 mils, which is equivalent to 0 0.6 to 0.68 fluid ounces. And then on the back, it basically says the same things that were written on the outside of the box. So we're going to open this up. We're going to take a very small amount onto my pointer finger. I'm going to go underneath my eyes. Just thin, and just they said just to apply a very thin layer. So that is what I am doing. Very thin layer. And you can actually use this underneath your uh, foundation primer, which is great because that's what I actually need to do. I'm going to put a little bit, so you have a little bit of dark spot up here. I'm really excited, and it feels very refreshing on the skin. Really, very, very, very light. I'm gonna apply the same amount of product we just applied. I'm trying to get it on camera. So that much, and I'm gonna do the same over here as I did on my right eye.
okay and I'm trying to look for a little bit over here and I think I think I got it every dark spot it's a little bit over here just a tiny bit so I took that little not the tiny amount apply that over here to help lighten up that dark spot over here. I know it's kind of hard to see on camera, but I'm doing my best, guys. Okay. And the same on the other side, so the same amount of product. That little bit. Okay, so I'm going to use this for two weeks, and then I'm going to do a check-in after one week. I'm going to let you guys know how it's working for me, if I see visible results, improvement, if I don't see improvement, I'm going to give you my open and honest opinions on it, and exactly what the results will be. So I thank you guys for taking the time to watch this quick little video. And I'm excited to see how this works out for me. And I will see you in my next video, which will be uploaded in about an hour and a half or so. See you then. Bye guys.